Hello everyone, welcome to study time. In this video, we are going to see class 4 marks, chapter 4, tick tick tick, worksheet with answers. Already, I have posted a video for introduction and textbook solutions for this chapter. I will give the link in the description box. Please go through that video so that it will be very easy for you to understand and solve this worksheet. Here, I am going to show 6 pages. So, each page contains few questions. I will give sufficient time. So, I will fix one minute. So, if time is not sufficient, you can just pause the video and answer the questions. Later which, I will be discussing the questions with answers. Let's begin now.
let's discuss the solutions now see in the first question write the following in short form 3rd July 1975 you can write it as 03 JUL for short form of July is JUL first three letters if you write that is the short form of month so 1975 or you can write 0307 1975 same way you have to answer next 25 November 2003 as 25 NOV 2003 01 JAN 2007 13 MAR 2001 or you can write 1303 2001 you can write your date of birth and independence day is 15 August 1947 26 Jan 1950 Christmas is 25 December 2020 Gandhi Jainti is October 2nd New Year 01 Jan 2020 Next Express the following in AM or PM See 12 noon is 12 PM 12 midnight is 12 AM 4.45 in the evening is 4.45 PM 8 o'clock in the morning is 8 o'clock 8 AM Next Calculate the number of days here you should be very clear whether they have given between or from to. If they ask between, you have to exclude the start date and end date. You should not count the start date and end date. If it is given from this date to this date, calculate the number of days. Then you have to calculate the days with from date and to date. See example between September 12 and September 23 so you have to start counting from September 13 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 so you should not count September 12 and September 23 so you will be getting 10 days for January 29 and February 5 see I have given here Explained here between Jan 29 and Feb 5 in Jan month you will be having two days 30 and 31 in February you will be having four days so 2 plus 4 is 6 days so the answer is 6 days for second one next for third one March 21 and April 1 so you have to start counting from March 22 from 22 to 31 you will be having 10 days you should not count March 21 and April 1 next between uh, April 3 and April 10 you will be having 6 days so 4 5 6 7 8 9 so 6 days between December 16 and December 28 you will be having 11 days so 17 18 19 20 and there you will be having 7 so 4 plus 7 is 11 days this is how you should calculate the number of days if date is given carefully note whether they have given between or from date and to date next change the following to 24 hour clock 2.30 afternoon is 14.30 15, 5.15 morning is here you should write it as 5.15 here it is not 17.15 17.15 is where you will write to confuse you I have written like that 17.15 you have to write for if they have given 5.15 evening, 6.45 evening is 18.45, 8.20 night is 20.20, 11.10 night is 23.10, 9 9.40 night is 21.40, 6.45 morning is 6.45, 12 midnight is 00. So till 
noon you will be having the same numbers from morning to noon you will be having the same number afternoon from afternoon you have to change 1 to 13 2 14 3 15 4 16 5 17 so like this it goes on till 12 for 24 so this is how you should change to 24 hour clock already i have posted in the introduction video how to convert 12 hour clock to 24 hour clock you have to just add 12 with the question so here you should add 12 so wherever you will be getting evening night so there you should add 12 next rearrange these events in order and draw, draw the line timeline and answer below see here i have drawn the timeline so when he was born first tooth sat up crawled stood up walked so it is a timeline then what you should do is see for uh, your reference i have given the timeline when she walked she walked almost at almost 10 months see i have written the completed month date next when she sat up she sat up by 4 months i have written the completed 4 month date next when she crawled she crawled after 7 months that is from july to february so it is 7 months august september october november december january february so 7 months completed this is how you should calculate the events so you have to arrange the events in order and then you have to answer the questions hope this video is useful and you all understand the questions easily if you have any doubt please leave a comment thanks for watching